Lex Friedman of originally MIT and the artificial intelligence podcast that he started. I can't help but compare him in my mind to Marcus Aurelius and Epictetus, one of whom was an emperor, another a slave, both of whom were the primary Stoic philosophers. He, Lex Friedman, seems to embody a lot of that sort of mentality of being personally responsible for things and only that which he can control does he worry about. It's pretty impressive, actually. And while he's a public figure and a lot of people have heard of him, for those who haven't, I'm introducing his work and, and you can check him out, I guess, on his, his work as his podcast. This guy is a strange attractor. He brings interesting people together for his podcast. He's an honest broker, as I said. He identifies with a book called The Idiot by Fyodor Dostoevsky and the main character there. I don't disagree with him. Peacemaker, I vote him personally the most likely to avert the big bad one, meaning the war that ends in something scary. This is a picture of the brain that I imagined for him. Biggest area is spent thinking about what is plasma. Next biggest is dog or cat, computer vision stuff. History, now, future, likes peace. I think he'd want that. Likes Kipling's poem, if. Don't know what's in that part there. Over here is fruit. Over here is some stuffed animal that he's always had that I can't remember what kind of an animal it is that is sometimes he's given away all his possessions except for this one animal, if I'm not mistaken. And this is a picture of him maybe giving it to a little Lex baby in the future. And then that's a sword and a shield because you got to protect that baby. And down at the base here is steak. Technology can help. Some people get scared of it. I, the reason that I'm endorsing Lex's sort of worldview is because I appreciate the fact that he understands past, present, future, but also doesn't fear technology to the point that we can't have nice things. I'm not talking about nuclear weapons. I know what Einstein said about them. There's Albert Einstein, you know, in that in that cloud. And here you can see these these guys here think the sky is falling. This one is throwing his hands up in the air. This guy's literally throwing his hands up in the air. They are in the air and his hair is on fire. So in the end, our mission is to avert doom. 